only thing I don't like about the Atari is the fact that it hasn't got a uh, power LED light when you switch it on, especially on a modern TV. If you're messing around trying to tune it in because it can be a pain, you want to know that the actual Atari is on and it is working. Now I have seen people put an LED in around here, actually drill into the case itself. But I want to have a go at actually mounting it inside the switch, an LED actually inside the switch. Right, so what my intention is, is to actually drill through here and actually mount some small LEDs here somewhere. One of these LEDs. Now, these are just some that I had lying around in my workshop and they are actually red. I think I would have preferred blue, but anyway. Um, is I want to mount that actually inside there, drill a hole, so the top actually illuminates when it's switched on. So, and watch me doing that, and if it works, I'll be doing it uh, on all my Ataris when I get in for service. So let's give it a go. Right, I've actually uh, desoldered the power switch here, and if I have a look, it is really really simple there you go on there they act like little springs and that goes on top of there and it actually just bridges across onto there now if you have, there is actually no problems with any of these switches on this board but um, if you do have a sticky switch if you give it a good cleaning some rubbing alcohol and get all this, it's, it's a little bit of blackness on there but it's not affecting the switch at all I'll give it a clean one, I've got it to pieces anyway and come up through there and actually mount the LED inside and two small wires coming out through there down onto the board onto the power regulator uh, we'll see how we get on. If it doesn't work, I have got a spare switch that I can use. So I thought I'd give it a try. Um, I'm going to put this in the vise now. See if we can drill through it. Okay, I did go in there and uh, ground it out a little bit, make it a little bit more even on top, a little bit neater. And my intention is to mount this LED inside here like that. Move through the bottom. And then put that back on top. So what I've decided to do is bring the wires in under these 
here. Okay, so we'll come out there and we'll actually run out underneath these. So what I've just done, started to just get the drill and make a little, uh, what would you call it, a little run off there, gap so the wire can fit in underneath. So hopefully you can see that, just get it lined up on the camera. Um, and what we've done, I drilled those out, like a little channel there for the wires to go in, and just fit nicely under these two slides. Okay, I finished it now, and you can see two wires leading out around here, and I've actually soldered them in over here. You can see that. It's the positive and negative. Okay, so we're going over there. Now, I put some power in and turn it on. There you go.